Adding JavaScript to Hippo Animator 2.3 Add a button to the library, and drag it to the editor. Then, add a text box, and drag it to the editor as well. The position of the items is not important. Change the script ID of the text box to text1 or any other name you like. This gives the script functions a way to identify this text box. View the movie properties by clicking any empty space in the editor. The general script is a place to declare variables and functions for use throughout the movie. Here, we add a new variable called counter and set its initial value to zero. Select the button in the library and open its on click script. Increase the value of the counter by 1. Then, add the text box set function. Set the script ID to text1. Add a message, including the value of the counter. Press play to test the movie. Every time the button is clicked, the counter increases by 1 and a message appears in the text box. Start a new movie, and add a text box. Set the script ID of the text box to, text1. In the movie properties, open the, on update script. This script is called every time the movie is updated, which could be many times a second. Declare a new date variable and call it current date the value of this variable is set to the current date and time by default using the text box set function set the script id to text1 and set the text to a message that includes the current date and time Click play to test the movie. The on update script will be called many times a second and the time and date will be displayed in the text box. Start a new movie and create any simple animation. Here, we add a circle that animates from left to right. The movie loops back to the start when the animation finishes. In the movie properties, turn off loop, so the animation only plays once. In the general script, add a new variable, loop counter, and set its value to zero. The on end script is called when the animation is finished, and loop is off. Increase the value of loop counter by one. If the value of loop counter is less than three, Go back to the start of the movie and play again. Click play to test the movie. The animation will play three times, and then stop.